As the UND Fighting Hawks prepare for the fall season, running back Otis Weah looks to build on a breakout year. Valley News Live sports reporter Devin Fry talked to the electric athlete who took the FCS by storm in the spring. Guys are excited to be back out here because it feels like something's unfinished. It's back to business for North Dakota's star running back. Otis Way is back to lead the ground game for the UND Fighting Hawks after a breakout spring season. Wea's dominant performance on the ground, which saw him average 104 rushing yards a game, led the Hawks to a share of the conference title. But Wea says they have unfinished business after falling in the quarterfinals of the FCS playoffs. I feel like we had an opportunity to uh, do something big with the program and take that next step. and. You know, we finished a little short and guys are excited to be back and get that opportunity to do it again. After rushing for 735 yards and nine touchdowns in seven games, Otis was named a preseason All-American and All-Conference running back. He's also been put on the watch list for this year's Walter Payton Award, which is given to the FCS's top offensive player after each season. Despite all of the accolades, Wayne knows he has to put in the work on the field. I mean, they're cool and all, but like I don't really care about them much. All I care about is just being out here and balling with the boys, in all honesty. You keep doing what you do best until they stop it. If they can't stop it, you just keep doing it. The most important stat for UND's star running back wins. A category he and the rest of the Fighting Hawks will look to add to as they start this fall season. For myself, it's just come back out here and learn everything over again and just play my game. Don't listen to the outside noise. It's not going to do me any justice. With the Fighting Hawks, Devin Fry, Valley News Live Sports.